Hello Cancers, happy birthday. So this is your weekly reading. I'm going to start with the tarot. Okay, so universe, what's the current energy between Cancers and the person that's on Cancer Vine? Some of you guys are dealing with Libras. Universe, what's the current energy? Nine of Pentacles and Eight of Pentacles. Okay, so, hmm. Nine of Pentacles is about being independent. Eight of Pentacles is about working. So some of you guys, okay, I feel like there's multiple groups in this position here. So I feel like for the single Cancers, you are feeling good, looking good. It's your birthday season. You've been working on you. Um, and a lot of people see that. And then I also see you guys been really focused on your goals, okay? Now for the Cancers that's in a relationship, I feel like you guys are not codependent on each other. You guys have an interdependent relationship, which is healthy. Okay, let's see what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, what would this person like to say? King of Pentacles, okay? So what this person would like to say to you, um, I feel like this is someone who their love language is, is I forgot what it's called, it's not word up. It's, um, it's like it's a monetary gifts, but their love language is like giving and receiving gifts. OK, that's their love language. So I feel like what they would like to say to you is that they're going to go all out for your birthday. Um, they really trying to show you that, you know, they're like you guys are meant to be because they're protect their provider. OK, universe, the person that's on. Cancer mind. What does this person keep a hidden from cancer? Page of Cups, the Emperor. Okay, I feel like this person wants to have a child <laughs> as well. So they want to have a child. Yeah, that's an interesting combination because the Emperor is a father, the page is like a child. So I feel like this person do want to have a child with you. <laughs> okay, so universe, the person that's on Cancer mind. How does this person feel about cancer? Justice. This person feel like you guys balance each other out, okay? Yin yang type of energy. Universe, the person that's on Cancer line. What is this person's true feelings for Cancer? King of Cups. Ooh, Queen of Cups. This person feel like you guys are counterparts. Now, the interesting part is that the positions, like how they're facing. So the Queen of Cups is facing the other way, while the King of Cups is kind of looking directly, but slightly on the right. So, and I do have this energy here. I feel like you guys work really well together. You guys don't need each other, but it's, it's like you guys work, like just work really well together. Like, um, it's not need, it's not codependent. You guys just mesh. Okay. So even though this person is similar to you, they're not exactly the same. Okay. You give, um, you give something that they're missing and then they give something that you're missing as well. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind. What is this person's intentions for Cancer? Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, this person is very invested. Okay, this person is probably thinking about marriage. I see they thinking about having a child. You see what else we get? Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind. My actions. Interesting. This is the only negative card. Okay. Actions are they going to take with you? Five Pentacles. And the Five Pentacles and the standard meaning represent someone for left on a code i see as a someone who is chasing someone as well okay chasing something that they lack because if you look here this guy it like he's like chasing her and she doesn't want to be bothered okay um probably there has been some discord as well they have been discord let me see what else i'm getting universe clarify the five of pentacles six of cups if it's cut by six of cups, two of pentacles. Yeah, so probably they want something, but you're not wanting it at this moment, okay? And it could be having a child. Some of you guys just have a child and probably um, that been kind of throwing off the connection dynamic, okay? Just because, you know, you're really busy being a mom um, to an infant. So it could be something relating to that, okay? But I do see some discord, um, and probably like they wanting something together with you, but you don't want that at this moment. Okay, so I do see that. I don't see some major strife energy this week. 
Um, the sign of this person could be Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or a Water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. There's some Libra too. Okay, so let's see here. Okay, so universe, give me a four-card spread. What messages do you have for Cancer? Sacrifice, Six of Wands. Justice again, Tower. Hangman. Rebirth. Universe, give me one my card. Okay, it came out called Dependency. And energy is moon. Okay, interesting. I have different energy here. So let's start with the good part. Okay, so you got sacrifice and six wands. So I feel like again, you guys have been really focused on your goals and it's coming through. Like you guys are seeing the fruits of your labor. Okay, it's wor worth the sacrifices. Then I got justice and tower. Again, something that you and your person want to balance out okay before things escalate then i got the rebirth and hang mad someone's still stuck in their ways and then there's codependency so the interesting part in the tarot it doesn't show that it shows that you guys have an interdependent relationship but now i see codependency so let's see what's going on and let's cover codependency the truth and hermit okay so this could be your energy because i'm thinking about cancer being in their shell so probably you feel like you need some space. Um, probably this person have been like you. You guys see each other frequently, and you just want some space. You probably want some me time, okay? And this person's growing more and more attached to you, and probably they're not as interdependent like how they were before, okay? So it's interesting how I have little contrary energy in this one. Let's look at the other deck. Universe, we have three cards, but let's just you have four cancers, marriage, wealthy man, universe, give me one more card, universe, give me one more card, mature woman, and despair, okay, yeah, so it's like, this person want more from you, and again, I see like this person want to get married to you, some of you guys are not ready to get married, or if you guys do have a relationship but no kids involved, probably they want you to live with them or live together and you don't know about that, okay? It's like you still want to have your something that's just for you, okay? So it's very specific, this reading, okay? So let's look at this deck. Universe, give me a four card spread. Okay, so there is follow um, fellow travelers, supports all around you in reverse. Then there is a time for healing in reverse, also like moon. Bring love into situation, new moon Aquarius in reverse. And then there is conclusions are within reach, full moon eclipse, gen energy is wandering path, enjoy the journey. Yeah, so some of you guys just don't want to be in a like in a serious, serious commitment at this moment, or some of you guys probably just want to have a sp like your space, okay? You may feel like you're kind of losing yourself and you just want to just stay grounded, okay? You may feel like probably this person is a little bit controlling, okay? I just feel like you guys just need to talk it out. I know cancer sometimes could be in their shell, but just really talk it out so the connection can remain healthy and so this person can be able to understand you more. So let's see. Give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Cancer, Trumpet, Ace of Pentacles? So I see a lot of success here. Some of you guys have Gemini in your chart. Four Wands, Mental Conflict, then Trumpet Success. Okay. So, yeah, I feel like. Mm, okay. So, probably they want something at this moment where you know that this can interfere with your goals. 
okay so probably you're gonna explain that to them but they're still gonna be persistent of wanting whatever they want with you together okay so I do see that so there is a conflict <laughs> okay there's a conflict um, but it's not major it just I feel like this person is like kind of adamant and you're adamant as well so let's see here Okay, so universe, give me a four card spread. I want to just see how for cancers. So yes, they consider. Look for a sign. Romance within the next few months. And there's something better. Wow, some of you guys are getting cold feet. Yeah, some of you are getting cold feet in a sense. Not necessarily you. You're about to get married and get cold feet. No, it's more so like you're, you like this person, but you don't want to feel like you're settling. Okay, and some of you guys just want some space to really process things. You know, it's just really your person. Okay, that's insane. Okay, that's like okay. here. Right, universe, give me a two card spread. I want to just see you have. Okay, so there's loving from the inside. I embrace my body. Joanna energy is ageless beauty. With great dignity and strength, I grow into the unique texture of my feminine soul. Okay, then loving from the inside. I embrace my body. I feel like with I like loving from the inside, ageless beauty, embrace my body. It's like you just want to just feel like you still you're still putting yourself first. You're not putting a relationship first before you. You're not putting someone else's needs and wants before you, okay? And then there is learn from the inside. It's a blessing to give myself the gift of my own presence. And then I embrace my body. I honor and embrace all my body. I'm receptive to her civic needs, okay? So that's the reading that I have for you, Cancers. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a personal reading with me at queenfittetarot at gmail.com.